A slow start was had by the Windsor Express, winning only 2 out of 10 games in the first two months of the season. But the Express are the only other team with championship experience aside from their first round opponent, the London Lightning. Windsor won back to back in the 2013-14 and 2014-15 seasons, putting them on the fast track to the championship if they can upset the league leading Lightning in the first round of the NBLC playoffs. The Express are led by none other than MVP and Defensive Player of the Year candidate Billy White. Former league MVP and the Lightning's Cameron Forte are sure to have a heavyweight battle in the first round best of five series. Nick Garth made his Windsor Express debut on April 20th and made an immediate impact scoring 16 points a game while shooting 44% from deep in his eight games played. White, a two-time NBLC champion, ranks among the top 10 all-time in six of nine career totals tracked by the NBLC. Notably, he's top three in all-time points, rebounds, and field goals. Yeah, you know what? I'm actually, so most times I'd sit here and say, be unhappy about a performance like that or whatever, because they let him back in the game. But the reality is, like Billy White is a heck of a basketball player. The City of Roses has a tall task ahead of them, but their 7-16 record isn't reflective of how good this team really is. We made some changes. We, uh, we got a couple players in, and just like Ja'Kai said, being able to practice uh, for a month and a half, we weren't able to have 10 guys that practice to be able to play full court. Ja'Kai Taylor puts up a solid 16 points per game as a starter while shooting an efficient 52% from the floor. The Express got an 18-point victory over London on April 22nd, which happened to be head coach Bill Jones' 150th victory in the NBLC. The Windsor Express are ready for the first round.